Microwave oven transformers. We've all seen them, right? This is a standard microwave oven transformer. And here is another one I've got. Let's look at the size of that bad boy. This came out of a huge microwave. And I can't wait to fire it up, but I'm gonna wait for it. But I have brought it out of the cold. So I'm going to wait for it to get a little bit warmer, so nothing is wet in there. This one proudly states it was made in the UK. Not China, or something stupid like that. It's plugged in, ready to be turned on. All wired up, We're using this transformer as the bias. I mean the ballast. Got my meter connected to see how much current the whole contraption is drawing. And, before I start, I'll just go through the um, safety disclaimers. These things are dangerous, okay? The output of this can kill you. The output of this definitely will kill you. So just keep that in mind if you think of doing this. And let's turn the power on. Okay, we're drawing 550 milliamps. Test the filament. Oh yes, we definitely got power. Draw an arc. Well, I don't think there's much problem with this transformer. Okay, well, that proves it's um, <clears throat> that's working. Nice little ball of melted metal on the end of that wire now. I wasn't actually, um, okay, I wasn't, okay, I wasn't all that impressed with those arcs. So I've added a capacitor. So hopefully now we'll get something a little better out of it. Thing welded itself there. Make sure that's discharged before I do anything. Okay. That was a little bit scary because I didn't know what on earth was going to go on then. I think maybe I should clamp this capacitor down before I do anything else. Okay, the capacitor is safely in my vise now, so if the wires decide to weld onto the screwdriver again, I'm not going to pull it about. Just turn the power on. You know, I really was expecting a little bit more out of this. Well, there we go. Big microwave oven transformer. This. Mm, this. Overcompensate for my voice went. This might be able to be run unballasted. I'm not so sure if I can. I might try that. I don't know how much power that's going to take, but that's going to be in another video. Because, uh, again, I'm running out of battery on my camera. 